If your throws were so powerful that you could leave your opponents motionless and unconscious after they hit the tatami, then I'd understand why you don't put a lot of effort into winning with Newaza. Hifumi Abe's Newaza victories are few and far between. He has a small number of wins with Osai Komi or pins. At times, some of these transitions from Tachiwaza to Newaza are a mix of World Champ meets Forrest Gump. However, he does have one Newaza submission victory. And we're going to have a look at that right now. So one thing I should make clear is I don't consider Newaza to be a weakness of Hifumi Abe. I don't believe he's ever lost a match due to Osai Komi or Pin. And he's never been submitted. I just think he probably just enjoys throwing people. And if I was as good as him, I'm sure I'd be doing the same. So here's the first throw of the match. We see uh, Drop Morote by Abe. And the opponent bases on one hand and pirouettes on his head to avoid the Ippon. And we see a fairly typical limited attempt at a Newaza follow-up from Abe. And this transition we see Abe hit the mat and his opponent makes a little attempt at going for a Kimura and Abe quickly switches out of it and gets back to his feet. We'll see Abe switch from a sleeve grip with his right hand to the collar and first he's going to look for an Uchimata and switches directly into Morote Seo and look he's controlled the arm and there it is the only career submission victory of Hifumi Abe Jujigatame. So notice here Uchimata attempt into a Morote. The key thing you'll see when I play this clip in slow motion is how after the Uchimata Abe pulls his opponent forward using his right hand giving him the Kazushi needed for the Morote Sayonage. And there we have well executed Jujigatame. His opponent tried sitting up Abe tilted his legs back into his opponent's face to keep his opponent's body down towards the mat as he finished this armbar. You can see the knee flares out. There's a tap. One more time here. Uchimata pull with the right hand into Morote Sayonage. And to make things even sweeter, we have a nice armbar finish. So if you're a fan of Hifumi Abe, I recommend subscribing because I have some interesting videos coming up soon. I'm going to have a video looking at what I consider to be his most exciting career match. I'm going to have another video looking at how Abe deals with the Georgian grip. And there's going to be at least one more video on Abe in the future. The topic of which I'm going to keep secret for now. Until then, thank you for watching. Remember to hit that subscribe button for more Hifumi Abe. Also more Uta Abe coming soon.